Hi friends, so this is Lakshman and welcome back to another video. In the today's session, we are going to talk about how to get your first job in the software industry. So everyone has dreamed to get software job as soon as possible after completion of their graduation or engineering. Okay, then how to get your first IT job? What are the main things I should follow to land your first job? Before going to discuss about the main topic, if you have visited our YouTube channel for the first time, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and also don't forget to share your net to share your friends as well. Okay, so without wasting our time, let us start the main topic, how to get your first job or how to land your first job in the software industry. So after completion of your graduation or, or engineering or there might be you have long career gap. So these people, first you have to do one thing that is most important one that is nothing but to choose the demand technology in the software industry. Ask your friends or colleagues or your uh, superior or who are knows very well about IT industry. You just take some guidance from the candidate. Which one is the most demand technology before choosing the IT course. The second step is you have to learn practically whatever technology you choose. I have seen majority of the people they are learning only theoretical part only. Of course theoretical part is useful to understand the concept. I am not saying theoretical part is not used. I am saying along with understanding the theoretical part you must learn that concept with practically. Okay then only you can easily land your first job in the software field because those days are gone. Nowadays, there is a huge competition in software industry to get software job. So therefore, so therefore, companies are used to filter the candidate by asking practical entry questions. They are not expecting the theoretical entry questions from you guys. With the theoretical knowledge, you may not get your first job if you are trying with experienced candidate. Of course, if you are fresher, yes, there is a chance are there. There is an opportunity there to get your first job as a fresher with theoretical knowledge as well. Because company used to check from fresher candidate only attitude. He is willing to learn new technologies or not? He is willing to do this job or not? Or he, he, this guy is fit for this position or not? And is this guy is uh, suitable for, for our company culture or not? And also is this guy have good communication skills or not? So these things only will check from the fresher get from the fresher graduate. So yes, if you have all these skills as a fresher, then you will get your first job. No doubt in that. But if you have career gap, you completed your education uh, three years back or four years back, and you are trying to get job as a fresher, and you trying to entry, and you are trying to get your first job, then you definitely require practical knowledge. Nowadays, most of the entries are going with scenario oriented concepts only. So if you know only theoretical knowledge and if you know only advantage, disadvantage, benefits, process, those things are not asking by any interview or any technical panel nowadays. They are asking scenario oriented entry questions. So to land your first job after having career gap, then you must require practical knowledge. Okay, so choose the platform wisely to learn any IT course who are giving, who are providing a practical knowledge and who are providing a project, it's better to choose those kind of platforms to learn any IT course. I highly recommend you, even freshers also, don't stop with the theoretical knowledge. So good to have practical knowledge as well to survive in IT industry very easily. So, and third one is, after learning any IT course, build any small projects. It might be portfolio websites or it might be chart application or a desktop application, whatever you interested, you just try to make a couple of websites with your own hands. So if you have this much practical knowledge, no one will stop you guys to land your first job. You can easily enter into the software field because nowadays there are huge job openings are there irrespective of the technologies. For every technology, there is job openings are there. So after build a couple of websites, then try then create one GitHub account and put your projects or code into GitHub and add that GitHub link in your pro, in your profile or resume. Because a technical panel or 
uh, HR people will check your achievement and how much coding skills you have. They will check everything. After building one good profile or resume and you added your uh, and you added your skill set in the resume. Uh, after adding your primary skill set and your GitHub link, the next step is you have to connect with the people which the skills relevant to your profile. You can find the IT industry people from LinkedIn. Okay, and also you have to upload your uh, resume or profile uh, in LinkedIn as well as Naukri job portal. And the final step is whenever schedule the interview, you have to show your real time skills and your real time practice, uh, your real time experience in the interview. Whatever couple of projects you have done, okay, you have to explore those experience in front of the interviewer. So this is the way to get your first job in the software industry. I hope these steps are very helpful to land your first job. So if you, if you really feel these tips are very informative, then don't forget to hit the like button and also don't forget to share to your friends as well. Okay, so we will meet with one more useful content video. Thank you very much.